Good morning, everyone. Welcome to The Balancing Act. I'm Olga Villaverde. And I'm Amber Melt. Happy New Year, everyone. Can you believe it? I can't believe it. So I can't exciting. believe it. So, Olga, are you rested? Are you ready to kick off the new year? Of course, I'm. it's a new year. You start over, you fix things, you make them better, and then you get more rest. I know that I would love more rest, though. <laughs> yes. And you know what? If you're like me and you need a few more Z's, we have maybe just what you need. That's you're going right. to want to stay tuned. I'm going to learn more <laughs> about something called bed match. Oh, I like the sound of that. So stay in fruit for that. Uh -huh, yes. And Chef Stuart O'Keefe is here with some yummy ideas using a healthy walnut drink. Ladies, you're going to go nuts over this brand new plant-based milk substitute drink that I got for you. I can't wait for you guys to try it. I love his accent. Oh, I know. And he's so cute. I mean, I married an O'Connor, so those Irishmen, uh-huh. And speaking of wonderful things from faraway shores, bear with me here, I'm making a segue. <laughs> We're going to show you how you can rent cars and more in major cities around the world. Okay, I'm always up for some international travel. Yes, well, let's pack our bags and fasten our seatbelts because... The Balancing X starts. Right now. Tossing and turning, no Z's on the horizon, waking up tired, well, maybe it's your mattress. How about making a resolution to get more sleep this year? Joining me is Bill Papetas from Mattress Warehouse, who is here to help make sure sleep does happen. Good morning, Bill. Good morning, Olga. How are ya? I'm doing great. Did you sleep well last night? I did. <laughs> Well, I got to tell you, I love to sleep, and I read lately that most people, at least the National Sleep Foundation, says adults need to get from seven to nine hours of sleep every day. And you've brought some great mattresses here. I, I kind of like, I really like this one. I'm going to sit down, but it's important to get all that sleep. Who's getting it? No one. Everybody's busy. They're running around all day with cell phones today. You're on your cell phone checking emails first thing in the morning when you get up. You're checking it late into the night. We try to cram so much into one day that we end up sacrificing sleep. And sleep's so important to have a healthy lifestyle. And it's important also to get a good night's rest with a good mattress. That really does make a difference. It makes a huge difference because the right mattress is going to let you sleep through the entire night. When you think about getting one, first of all, you start thinking, oh my gosh, the time and, and just having, it's, it's boring, right? It's, it's boring. boring and it's not comfortable. You're going into a store, some strangers watching you on a bed. It's strange, right? Lie down and you're yeah. like, okay, could you leave, right? Exactly. So what are you doing to help change that? We're using technology in our mattress warehouse stores to help change the way you buy a mattress. So we know that most of the mattresses in any given mattress store are the wrong mattresses for you. So using our bed match technology, we're able to then get the right mattress for you and allow it to go through, measure, take measurements of your body, and then make sure that's the perfect mattress. Show me how that works then. Great. I go to a store and I say, okay, I need to find a good mattress for myself. How yes. does this technology bring me in? Well, we can do it right now. Okay. So you're gonna go right here and you'll enter a little bit of information about yourself, Olga. Enter your name by selecting the letters on the screen. So I put my name first. Yep, name goes first. Excellent. I've never seen this before, by the way. And then now you're just gonna answer some questions. I'm a female, my age. Do I have a sleep partner? Yes. Is he here? No. Is that bad that he's not here? No. Bed match can, it'll ask you some additional questions about your husband. Okay. And then it'll do a virtual bed match on him. Knowing your preferred sleeping position is very important in determining your proper pillow thickness. We'll need the position you prefer to sleep in to recommend the proper pillow. That would be my side. I like to sleep on my side. Do you sleep on your side? I do. Okay. Which side of the bed do you sleep on? The right. My height, I'm very short. Do I have heartburn, circulatory issues? No, I don't have any of these problems. Thank goodness. Right, so we'll skip that then. Okay. I like to, in bed, let's see, I tend to watch TV and I'll read. That's about it. Knowing where you experience aches and pains is essential in recommending beds that will provide the best postural support and pressure relief. If you experience any pain in these regions, please select them at this time. Any of these pains? No. Any aches and pains? No Nothing. aches and pains? Great. That's good. All right. Now enter in your husband's name. All right. Jose. He sleeps on his side. Great. Sleeps on his back, but he starts snoring and then I have to turn him over. So there you go. Uh, let's see. Six one. His weight. He has no aches and pains. No aches and pains? Great. We'll Next. skip that then. And he has no circulatory no issues. No issues? Great. We'll skip that then. Does he do anything in bed? Watch TV? He read? watches TV a lot. Great. Diagnostic bed is now ready. Please lie down, ensuring that your lumbar region is within the lines on the diagnostic bed cover. So if you lay down right here, we'll start the process. 
Okay, so what's going to happen now? It's going to take some statistical measurements of your body. It's going to measure how your weight's distributed. No two people are weight distributed exactly the same. Okay, so am I good here? You're perfect. So right now, I'll go. what it's doing is it's taking 18 statistical measurements of your body. It's going to measure your weight distribution. It's going to measure the distance between your shoulders, the distance of your hips. It's going to measure from your hips down to your leg. It's going to measure your lumbar curve and also the flexibility of your lumbar section of your body. And it's going to take all those statistics and then it's going to compare them into the database of over 9 million bed match users and it's going to recommend the perfect mattress for you. Well, that's very helpful. Now I'm watching. I see it has me horizontally and I see these little dots dropping down. What's that? That's actually the measurements, and you can see how it's measuring the curvature of your body. You can see how much weight is near your shoulders, your hips, your legs, your head. And it's going to take these measurements, and then it's going to start selecting the right mattresses by knowing the amount of support and the amount of pressure relief you need to get a great night's sleep. A lot of time has been spent educating the consumer, especially the amount of things that go wrong if you don't get enough sleep. They've tied lack of sleep into heart disease, early onset, um, Parkinson's, Alzheimer's, cancer. It's so important to get a good night's sleep to prevent all these diseases. And sleep is just as important as nutrition and exercise and getting a long, healthy life. Now it's actually doing, obviously, my body on this side. What about the fact that my husband's not here? He's not here, but we did virtual bed match. So you actually entered in some more information about your husband. Mm -hmm. And it took that information, matched it up against the 9 million people that are in the bed match system. And then it's gonna give you a result that works both for you and your husband. I see these patterns on the back that are reddish and bluish. What are those? That's actually the distribution of your body weight, and it's measuring where you have your weight sitting on your body. So is it evenly distributed? Is it you know, more, more towards your shoulders, more towards your hips? It just asked me to turn. Yes, Sorry. turn on your side now. Now it's measuring the curvature of your body since you're a side sleeper. Now turn back to your back. Okay. Boy, I don't even want to get up. This is this is great. This feels so good. So it's going through right now, and it's taking that selection of up to 90 mattresses, and it's going to narrow it down to six for you. So it's checking off now, in green, the mattresses that are going to be good for me. Yes. Your bed match diagnostic report is now ready. Can I get gonna, up? You can get up, and it's going to print out the report for us now. Really? So you said 90 mattresses, you know, and it's going to print out? Over 90 mattresses in our stores, and this is going to narrow it down to the six best mattresses for you and your husband. Wow, this makes it a lot easier. A lot easier, a lot less stressful. Mattresses are an expensive purchase. You want to make sure you're getting the right mattress. All right, so what did it suggest? Well, one of the mattresses it suggested is the Grand Summit, which we have right here, which oh. you can try out. Really? And of all these six, is this the best one, the top one, or are they all just comparable? They're all good. Now it's a matter of what you feel most comfortable in. So any of these six will work for you. Now you've got to select the one that's most comfortable for you. Oh, my gosh. So wait, the Grand Summit? The Grand Summit. This is it? This one right here. Okay. This is really cool. It is cool. <laughs> I've got to tell you, this is And you've got to trust the technology. It's, it's fantastic. Oh, I do. I do. I do. Let me see. Oh, my gosh. This feels great. Wow. This is really You should feel no pressure on your hips right now. You should feel, be very comfortable because it's giving you the right amount of support and it's allowing your body to drift into the mattress to give it the proper support and alignment. And I can only imagine how many people pick a mattress, they get home and they realize, you know, because they didn't have this technology, I got the wrong one and they regret it. They regret it. It's a, it's a big purchase. And you're not sure you're buying the right one. You're not sure if it's the right technology. There's so much technology in mattresses today. You want to make sure you're getting the right technology for your body. Sit with me here. All right, so what happens if I don't have the time to do this and I can't go to a store or lay down for the few minutes? We've actually implemented Bedmatch on our website. So if you go to sleephappens.com, you can go through Bedmatch virtually. It'll ask you additional questions, just like you did with, with your my husband. husband. Exactly. And then it'll give you a choice of six beds and then you can research all six on the website, or you can go into one of our mattress warehouse stores and try them, or you can make your purchase right on the website after researching. Wow. And at the end of the day, really a big difference for someone's overall health and even happiness for that matter. Yes, sleeping well is gonna make you healthier, it's gonna make you happier, it's gonna give you a long, healthy life. So for our viewers, where can they get more information on the perfect mattress? They can go to sleephappens.com, they can take the virtual bed match, and then they'll see their selection of six mattresses. They can research online, 
purchase online or they can visit one of our mattress warehouse stores to try out the mattress. Because sleep can happen. Sleep does happen. Thank you so much. Thank you, Olga. Great time. And of course, you can go to our website, thebalancingact.com. I like this one, the Grand Summit. This is the best. I love that we've delved even deeper into the science of sleep because who doesn't need a better night's rest? But you can't go to sleep right now because up next we've got Chef Stuart O'Keefe. He's got the latest trend in dairy-free plant-based milk substitutes. I'll turn to that. Stay with us, we're coming right back. We're kicking off a year-long series with the very talented chef Stuart O'Keefe. That's right. Each month he's going to be in the kitchen with a taste of the Mediterranean. Mm, today, a refreshing alternative to almond and soy milk. Oh. Want to try one of the tastiest drinks around? This drink is a nice refreshing change to your usual almond and soy milk. Plus, it's a healthy and natural plant-based alternative. It's walnut drink. Welcome to In The Kitchen, I'm Chef Stuart. Okay, let's talk about walnut drink for a second. I absolutely love this stuff, and I'm gonna show you some fun little things that you can do to incorporate it into your daily life. First of all, let's start over here with this. So this glass of Borges Natura has the same benefits as eating five whole walnuts. I'm just gonna take a quick little taste. I absolutely love this stuff, I could drink it all day. Now one cup provides omega-3 fatty acids for heart health, it's low in saturated fat to control cholesterol and low in salt and sodium for healthy blood pressure. And now when baking with just walnut drink, you want to substitute the milk with walnut drink. It's that easy, just like these beautiful brownies that I have here. And don't forget, walnut drink in your coffee in the mornings. You need that to get your day started. Now let's get to some of these smoothies. Chocoholics, I got you covered. So right here I have a glass of walnut drink with two dates, two spoons of sugar-free cacao powder, a spoonful of chia seeds, and a handful of spinach. All in this, that's where you kind of get the green effect here. Now here's another beauty, a sweet, thick, and tasty burst of pure energy to start the day. The ideal smoothie for those who are on the go. I mean, I'm on the go all the time, so this is perfect for me. I made this one with a glass of walnut milk, a medium-sized banana, eight strawberries, a cup of steamed beetroot. I know that kind of sounds weird, but it tastes really good, believe me. A teaspoon of sesame seeds, and a dash of spirulina. Now here's the thing. Borges Natura rice and walnut drink is made from perfectly ripe California walnuts combined with white rice and water. Here's what I like to do with walnut drink. There's a bit of alcohol in there. It tastes good, you know, a long day. I think we all deserve one. So what I have here is I have a, uh, a martini glass and what I've done is I've got chocolate syrup and drizzled it all inside the glass. I have my trusty cocktail shaker here. Now I have some creme de cacao. I have one ounce of creme de cacao. You can do more. It's a harder day for you. You can put in a bit more. We have some vanilla vodka. Of course, we have the walnut drink, star of the show. And we are just going to give that a shake. I want to get it nice and cold. So I have ice already in here. I also love to have this drink after like a dinner or something as like a dessert cocktail. It's really good too. So I have some chocolate wafers in here, so I'm just gonna get a rolling pin and just roll them and break them up really small. And what we're gonna do is kind of like a margarita. You're gonna dip the martini glass into the chocolate syrup, and then we're gonna do, we're gonna dip it right into the chocolate crumbs. And it's as simple as that. Okay, got a cocktail here. So we're gonna pour it into the glass. Looks amazing. Want to try Natura Walnut Drink from Borges? Order a Star Experience box with two liters of walnut drink at trynatura.com or our website, thebalancingact.com. And don't forget to share your favorite recipes with us. And if you want more great recipe ideas, check out my book, The Quick Six Fix. Happy New Year, everyone. All right, well, I'm ready to hit the road in style. And luckily, we have some great advice coming up, especially if you're traveling to Europe. Stay with us.
resolution include more travel? I know mine does. And if it does and yours does, what better way to see the sights than cruising abroad in your own car? Boy, it sounds romantic. Taking to the open road, discovering new international destinations, stopping for some great food along the way. Well, here to get us zooming around is Karen Schaefer of Auto Europe. Karen, thank you so much for being here. Yeah, happy to be here, thank you. Oh, I am just dreaming now about being on the open road in Europe. Um, you know, most people, I think, when they think of a road trip, think of going across country here in the States. But would you say international road trips are becoming more popular? They're definitely becoming more popular as travelers are becoming more adventurous. Um, people are really trying to get off the beaten path, get away from the crowded tourist landmarks, and really explore the place that they're visiting. So it, this gives them an ability to do that. Um, Europe in particular is popular because you can reach so many countries in a small period of time. And so by renting a car, um, how would you say Auto Europe is, is helping travelers with their plans abroad? Well, Auto Europe started back in the 50s, so we were around way before the internet, really helping travelers navigate the complexity of renting a car. Um, so we've been doing it for 60 years and kind of know the ins and outs there. Um, as a global car rental aggregator, we really pull together all of your options into a single place, making it really easy to search and compare all the options available to you to pick just the right car for your trip. We pre-screen all the suppliers, we make sure we negotiate the best rates, and then we pass that on to the travelers. I love it. I've used your site. It's so easy to navigate. Um, it really is this one-stop shop, which takes some of the intimidation about renting abroad out of the picture, yep. right? Because we just want to go and have it be an easy deal. And I will say, if and when things go wrong, Auto Europe has a wonderful reputation as being a, a place that we can call 24-7 for help. Yep, in addition to uh, helping select a rental, our 24-7 rental specialists are there to answer any questions, resolve any concerns during your trip. Uh, we can work with our local contacts if you're not familiar with the language and help resolve everything from a flat tire to just understanding some of the local travel laws. So if we're heading to Europe now, are there certain cities that you think are trending? Yeah, um, we're seeing a lot of upcoming reservations for this year in uh, Dublin, Lisbon, Barcelona, and Munich are kind of the top four places people are starting their road trips in Europe. Okay, and if we are sort of ready to get out there and hit the Autobahn, what would you say are some tips that we need to know for renting a car in Europe? Every itinerary is going to be a little different, but some of the most popular things that we want to make sure people really consider carefully are car size. So. People always think, oh, there's going to be two or three passengers, but not really always taking into consideration the amount of luggage they might have. So make sure that you're picking a car large enough for both of those. The second being transmission. Um, most Americans uh, like to drive automatics, and most European rental cars are manuals. So if you need an automatic transmission, you want to make sure you rent well in advance. Uh, we're lucky that our partnerships with our suppliers give our customers some, some preferential access to those high demand vehicles. And I'd say the third thing, and this is important, is coverage. So whenever possible, we recommend taking the full coverage with a zero deductible option. It's gonna save you a lot of money on potential high damage costs, as well as allowing the suppliers to not have to hold a large deposit on your credit card while you're traveling, so you have access to your full balance on your credit card. And what about local fees? Can you guys um, help with that? Yep. So it's important to understand that in most cases, there are going to be some local fees. Okay. Um, so it's really just a matter of understanding uh, your rental agreement and, and, and looking at those in advance. So there's no surprises at the, at the counter. Be real, an educated traveler. And again, with AutoEurope.com, you know you've got this reputation. And if there's any questions about these fees, if there's any questions at the desk, yep. we can call you 24-7. Exactly. All right. Well, if we're ready to go and hit the Autobahn, Where's the first stop that we should go to? AutoEurope.com. Okay, AutoEurope.com. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you. Uh, I'm ready to go hit the road. Yeah, let's go. I mean, girls trip? <laughs> All right. I'm in. Let's go. All right, so remember, you can go to AutoEurope.com if you're ready to book your car trip and zoom around Europe. And if you want more information, you can always go to our website, balancingout.com, for more information. You know, I gotta try that bed match. It was nice, wasn't it? Yes, and who doesn't want a great night's sleep? Oh, please, I need it every day, two kids. All right, you're gonna find out one day. Thanks so much for joining us. Hope you have a great morning. And of course, you can check out our website, thebalancingact.com. You can follow us on Twitter and Facebook because we're everywhere. That's right. Uh-huh. Thanks for watching, everyone. <laughs> See you next time.